Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a Yankee Candle haul of my two trips when I went to the outlet to go pick up some festive candles to uh, spice up the year, pretty much. So, I have one big bag here, which is like this, the bag for life. And I have this other one here. Now, because I ended up spending a certain amount, they basically gave me another bag with a mystery box and we're gonna open that on camera because I have no idea what's in here. And we're gonna see what actually was in the mystery box. Now to start off, I'm going to show you these ones. I got six of these, and these are the Misty Mountain candle. It looks literally like this. It's got a lovely wooden top on the top, and a two wick in there, so it burns pretty nicely, and smells amazing. And this had a good special on it, so I picked up six of these. It's a very it's a very musky kind of smell, but it is very fragrant as well. It's more of like a, a kind of sedari kind of cologne-y, mountain -y smell. I did pick up, I do have a lot of these ones as well, and it is the Merry Mint Chocolate, and it's from the Home Inspirations range. So it looks like this in a lovely mint green kind of jar. Super fragrant, really smells of hot chocolate with an extra little bit of mint in there. I do love this fragrance. It is one of my favorites and I did already have one of these and I burned through it so fast that I ended up buying more. I got four of these. So next up we have, I'm actually burning it right here in my little Havana range. I think the set was where the, you got the little, the tea light lampshade and you got the little dish as well. And it is the luscious pumpkin trifle and it is this really kind of pumpkin-y, kind of light caramel color. Super fragrant. I did see a lot of reviews online saying this wasn't as fragrant, but if you're burning this in a really big room, you're not gonna smell as great, but in a smaller room, this smells so good. It does smell like pumpkins. Very sweet pumpkins, like a very fresh pumpkin pie, like just out the oven. This is really great for the autumn kind of time. And I'm a sucker for pumpkins. If you know me, I love pumpkins. So I have three of these. I've almost actually finished this one. I'm down to about this much left of it because your boy likes the luscious pumpkin trifle. I'm kind of set to go for the year with these. So if you are a person who loves Halloween and want that smell all year round, pick these up. They're great. The other one I picked up is the poached pear flambe and it's this one here. Oh my God, it smells literally like pears soaked in like some kind of liquor, I don't even know. Like, oh. if you're detoxing and having a sober month, this is like not safe to have around, like literally. It smells so good. It smells like, it literally smells like an alcoholic drink that you have with your friends and you're getting into the spirit of Christmas. It's that kind of a smell, you know what I'm saying? The last one I got, which I actually can't find now, so I'm kind of like low-key happy I actually picked this up, was the Cuban Mojito. I love mojitos. They're one of my favorite cocktails. And it smells so good. So my mom did buy me, if you saw my favorites ages ago, I did show it off, the small Yankee Candle candles in the Havana range. And this is literally the giant size of the small one. And it looks like this, beautiful green. Gonna burn this next summer. Glad to like get a nice summer scent. They said that once I purchased so much, they gave me a free mystery box. I can get it out, let's see. So this is the box. Ooh, it looks like this. Right there. This is what it looks like on the inside, actually. It looks like that. All right, so the first three things I see here are some votives, the small little votives. And it is star anises and orange. That's kind of cool. We have the Glad Tidings. It's okay. These are very not really scented as much. I can't really smell a lot from those. Uh, crackling wood fire. Very musky. Very, very, very nice and piney. Super piney. Like that one. Okay. Then, oh, a trio. So there's a trio in here. A trio of small candles, I do believe. Oh, they're all Christmas cookies. Okay. So I have a, a triple set of, can you see that? Christmas cookie. 
These really do smell like a sugar cookie. With like some other kind of vanilla y. Ooh, okay, so this is a large candle. Wow, okay, it's a medium size. I thought it was a large candle. And it's snow in love. It looks like that. How cool is that? That's a nice, it's a nice little scent in there. Oh, that one's really nice. But yeah, that's it. So you got this little mystery box that contained a medium, three minute, three small candles, and then three votives. So you get a little smell of like the crystal, bit of that. You get a little selection of what the Christmas range is through this mystery box, which is pretty cool. So I hope you enjoyed this little candle review video. I did go a bit kind of overboard with some candles because of the good deals that they had on. I thought, I, why would I resist, you know, not getting some? So that being said, I had to avail and I stocked up for a really long time. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a big old like, smash that like button. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell for more videos and to be in the know for if I do any future giveaways or anything. And leave a comment down below. What is your favorite candle from Yankee Candle or somewhere like Bath and Body Works? I wanna know. Leave it down in the description below and I'll get back to you guys. So I hope you're having an awesome day wherever you may be and I'll talk to you next time. Bye bye. So the video you're just watching has just ended, but don't worry, you can go watch one of my old videos right here, or you can go and subscribe right here, and be notified when my next video comes out so you don't have to miss any of the action. So thank you, and goodbye.